Hey, it's Greg Tepper from the Tepper Group at Keller Williams, bringing you the 2018 real estate market recap. So if you remember how we do this, we compare the previous year to the year before that. So we're doing 2018 versus 2017, which is year over year comparison. And if you remember last year, when we compared 17 to 16, there were some signs of market weakness, especially in the West St. Tammany, Covington, Mandeville area. So let's dig in as what we've got going on on the North Shore for 2018. As you can see, Covington, Mandeville. Now remember, green is good, red is bad. It doesn't matter if the arrow is up or down. So you'll see total sales is up, all right? Average price is up still a little bit. Average days in the market is a red arrow, so that means it took longer to sell, slower time to sell it, took more, so that means that's, a, that's why it's red, all right? And also the expired listings is up by a whopping 14 plus percent. That means that's a home that was on the market for six months and came off the market because it did not sell. So while your price may go up, it's taking longer to sell it. And meanwhile, you're still paying things like insurance, utilities, maintenance. And yes, a lot of us are paying a mortgage too. So consider that while you're waiting for this higher price, but you're taking a lot longer to get it sold. So that price increase is probably negated by that holding time that you have. So that's West St. Tammany. Moving on, Slide L. All right, total units is up. Average price is up. Days on market is up by a little bit, not a whole lot. And then expired listings is actually down. That's down by 8%. So that means there's a lot more homes that are selling in Slide L. And we saw a strong Slide L market last year too. So that's great for that area. Congratulations, Slidell. Well done. Next up, Hammond Ponchatoula area, Southern Tinge Baho. All right, total units up, average price up by like 4%. Average days in the market down. It's taking shorter to sell a home in Hammond and Ponchatoula, which is great news for that market. At the same time, kind of paradoxically, a number of expired listings is up too. So if a home is priced right and it's staged right, it's going to sell faster. But if it's priced wrong or the staging stinks or the condition stinks, it's not going to sell. And there's probably more of that going on. And that's why you see that number up. So that's 2018 in a recap. I will tell you 2019 to date has been phenomenal. Interest rates have kind of stabilized. The Fed has made it seem like we're not really going to go crazy with them. So let's prime the pump. And if you're looking to buy or sell, we're happy to help. Thanks for tuning in. Bye-bye.